In the next 10 to 20 years, there will be no more use for oil. That is happening. Countries are now moving away from fossil fuels to this and so. What? But people must eat. Agriculture is the, going to be the next uh, frontier, just like it used to be for Nigeria. And where do you really have this? It's the same. No, that's where you have the land, you have everything. So let's just put it this way. Take a country like Netherlands. Netherlands is smaller than Niger State. Niger State is bigger than Netherlands twice the size of Netherlands. But Netherlands exports agricultural products to the tune of about $180 billion. I don't think Nigeria has gotten up to $100 billion from oil. So you could see the potentials that are there when we harness ourselves properly and move away from this contraption that is today that makes everybody feel that you just have to work for a center that is overloaded, over bloated, and very difficult to manage. Would you agree that at the heart of all of this is the talk of oil? There's not, at the heart of the feeding bottle <laughs> economy is proceeds from oil. That one is it. And that's what we want to change. We want to say, let's move to a knowledge-based economy. Let's move to, and let's just put it this way. Ten years ago, the top ten companies in the world with the largest revenues were oil companies, Shell, you know, Dexaco, and so forth. But today, the top ten companies are technology companies, Google, uh, and, and so forth. So you now see that we're actually moving away from you know, fossil-based things. That's to, the world to, to is moving knowledge. away. The world is moving away. But not Nigeria. We're, we're sitting here, and this whole conversation and this whole uh, thought we're doing is, how do we share what is coming from? When that dries up, and we're just asking Nigerians that it is time for us to think beyond today.